The launcher has been constructed, and Stromfell's last shanties have been sung. The verses combining into a potent charm, imbuing the harpoon with great power. The final verse revealing a cavern in the deeps where Amana lurks. The power of the seas can now unite as one and curse Wolfheart's harpoon with the strength needed to fell Amana. Okay. Interesting. So all three verses of the Lost Sea Shanty have been discovered and sung, unleashing the invocations of potency hidden within the lyrics. At last, the Star Metal Harpoon now has the power to slay the merworm known as Anna Aminar. But there is one who has been following this ill-gotten quest since the beginning, one whose ship has been stalking yours from afar on the horizon. Now you are poised to strike. He steps forward to claim the prize for himself. You are merely interlopers, for the sea beast allies itself to the high elves, who are the mortal enemies of your stalker. Now your use is at an end. He will take the harpoon, kill the beast, and revel in the infamy. That is, of course, only if you let him. <laughs> okay, a dark elf. We've now got the third verse. Okay. I need you. Sorry, be back in a sec. Sorry about that interruption. Um, I need those gunners back. So it was one of these guys and three of these guys. Ah, I lost my Mongol hunters too. Okay. Um, I'm gonna replace them with I think we'll get another rotting leviathan. Okay, Arthur, you can get Deadly Onslaught now. Of the fleet. Um. Oh, really? How did he all of us? Oh my word! Okay. Blood and plunder. Land all well, I'm not going to attack him then. Luther, Luther, just move I'm out of Skeggy ever no so pray, slightly. No you can go into Skeggy. That is not a settlement. Sail away. Oh, sorry, a harbour. Um. Why are they chasing me now? At last, 
we will feast. I need to go replenish up here. The sea brings death. <clears throat> and let's see what I can get. Let's get the ward save on something. That seems nice. Um, extra winds of magic. So we can actually use Fate of Buna. And now... You should be able to... My madness is not weakness. Go to that battle. Um, let's go to the Slan Gold one first. Amass madder is due. I don't even need to battle this one, but I'm gonna battle the story battles. Ah, the onslaught. Because they're fairly interesting. Generally, <clears throat> well, this is just going to be a slaughter. Let's go. That mob of reptilian scoundrels traveled far for their precious gold. It must be important. What are they hiding? What secrets does it contain? The winds of magic have shunned me for too long. My thoughts constantly at odds with one another. All the while, those Bulbous slant toad priests conjure great spells for their futile causes. And now they hide behind a glyph enchanted tower. I must reconnect with my powers. I must silence the voices in my head. Yep. It's definitely another. Bring me that slam gold, or I'll send you back to your watery graves. Yes, Julia, Ooh. you're gonna see Queen Bess at its best. Um, okay, first of all, let's get you guys spreading out into formation. Then you guys. Oops. Spreading out into formation. You can go there. And you can go there. I think you can, yes. I don't know, that's what I'm trying to do, Julia. And see what actually happens. Because that would be cool if you can fix his mind completely. So I think after this quest... Is when that happens... Okay. Everybody is into position. Enemy reinforcements. Oh, goody. Turn this way.
Nice hit there. Do currently have Van Geist Revenge on me, which is nice. What is coming from behind? Temple Guard, Slime Mage, Troll. Yeah, that'd be really good if you got a, a buff like that. Come on, quickly, get rid of these guys. Would you? Let's get some meteors coming down over here. Bombardment, whatever they call it. Okay, you back here, Luther. You can come back here too. Because they are going to be completely routed. Queen Bess is almost out of ammunition. So. Maybe her last couple of shots I get firing over this way. Ooh, nice. Oh. oh, it's going to be too slow. Oh, no. Way too slow. Okay. All of them are chased off. Let's now get you turning around and attacking this way. Get you into there. Move. You. Get a mob to appear that way. Charge! Invocation of Nehek. Don't really want that, actually. You, charge in. Uh, let's get you to do a breath attack on him. Yeah, ship to the face is generally pretty handy. <laughs> oh, that's annoying. Come on. Get into him. You into him too. Charge! Chase them all down. I think they're gone. God. Is that it? Yep. Cool. Is that the... Recollection of his mind? Do we have him fully with himself before we go face the... the something worm? Worm? of the sea, whatever the hell it's called. The pirate king only knows victory. Let them be. Power. More power. We get 
That. Luther's mind restored. Hey, nice. Having long sought the means to regain his former spellcasting abilities, Luther's desire to repair his damaged mind has finally been realized. For years, the mental instabilities caused by this molt by his multiple personalities have prevented him from welding the winds of magic, but no more. The lore of the deep eludes him no longer. All shall fear the pirate king more than they ever have before. Nice. Magic resistance. Greatly reduced power recharge rate. And raise dead cost down. Okay, now the only thing I've got left to do... ...is... ...kill... The worm. Oh no, I've got to battle this guy first because he wants to take my ability to get rid of the worm. <clears throat> hey, definitely want to get him. So, who do I get rid of? I think we get rid of one of the Rotting Leviathans into this guy's army. Yeah, I will boot that. Let's give you this Rotting Leviathan. And then I can get the Gallows Giant. Perfect. It was never in doubt. Okay, quickly see what we've got. Ward save, that seems pretty good. Yeah, let's change to that one. No better weapons at the moment. We've got that, so we can use that. Shortly. What could I get instead of that? Uh, nothing really. Okay, cool. Luther is ready next turn for his battle with the the vampire coast prevail. Mirworm. Worm. Um Let's give you that missile resistance. And all bones on deck, Admiral of the fleet. I guess I'm gonna end my turn here. Missile damage on the flame ship. Do you mean the um? Yeah, yeah, I know what you mean. Yeah, it's, yeah, insane. 5,000 and something, I think it is. Yeah, the walker. It's really short range, but crazy amounts of damage. It does like a flamethrower kind of thing. Okay, cool. I don't actually know what spells he has for Lore of the Deep. I'm assuming it will show me when I head in. Hopefully. Make 
this quick. It's only got four ammunition though, so I've never really used it all that much. I use it once in a multiplayer game and it seemed to do a lot of damage but it, the ammo didn't go down so I wasn't sure if it was firing or not. But I guess we'll see how it goes it shortly. Okay, give you the melee attack, and we are now going to head into this battle. Let's go. All bones on deck. Okay, Charles Aldo, who is that? This looks like the final battle. Okay, I'm gonna give that extra ammunition to you and reload time. Holy mackerel. Yeah, this must be the final battle. What the hell? Jeepers creepers. Look at it all. Not the onslaught. Okay. The chart is plotted, and the sails below as the ship follows the course revealed by the map. The order is given. Drop anchor. Your crew descends into the depths in search of the beast. Amana is close. The ancient mailworm roars. In defiance or anguish, the predator is not used to the role of prey. From the shadows comes another to claim the prize of slaying Lothan's guardian beast. Wolfheart's bane will become Fellheart's glory, but you are in his way. That's very weird that the campaign lets you make an alliance with him and then he attacks you. <laughs> uh. Okay, yes, as you said, Julia, I am going to have to be wary of the exploding corpses. <clears throat> Your hunt is over. The Merworm is not yours to slay. It is a creature of Mathlan, Lord of the Deeps, and only I am charged to cull in his name. It has been amusing watching your sea-racked corpses stumble and dodder as you tracked the prey, but Aminar is Lothan's guardian, a creature aligned to the Asser. Who are you to interfere in such an ancient rivalry? The prize is mine, and mine alone. The beast is summoned. Your use is at an end. Whoa. How Prepare could they stay calm the with Lord. that behind them? <laughs> Holy hell. Does it at least let me set up? Whoa, that's a freaky shadow. Very well. Nope. It does not. Okay, let's just quickly have a look. I have not been able to see the spells we get for this. 
Um, okay, so we get Tide Call. We can summon Denizens, Rotting Prometheans. We get that Van Geist Revenge, which is a very, very good spell if you can hit it. Does a lot of damage. Spiteful Shot gives us extra accuracy. We can get a Hex for less attack and leadership on them. A Vortex that slows them down. Okay. Okay, interesting. So. who in that case, what do we have over here? Blackguard, so that's a good target to start off with. I would agree with that. E okay. Not too bad. So, I definitely... Actually, the way you guys are set up already is not too bad, realistically. Uh, you guys, on the other hand... I want you to go there. You to go there. You standing over there is not a good idea. Not a good idea at all. Okay. And you guys just spread out in a nice line along the back there. Okie dokie. Where is the other Black Guard and Nagaron? There they are. You come back here. You go over there. Seize of slaughter. I really don't mind if they just want to stand there and take damage. It's all good with me. Definitely all good with me. You guys can be on three. I want you to focus them. Stop. Pull back. Quickly, focus those. You guys, focus that. Now fly back! Now, I see it. Oh god, get back guys! Attack! Move forward! Okay... Whoops! You, get that! Get that! You get in there. Come on. 
Hey, you, get over there, get them. You need to pull back. Come on, chase them away. Those reinforcements come from. Okay, you guys pull back. Get rid of that guy. You get into them. Come on. No! Stop chasing! Pull back! You stop chasing too! Pull back! Okay, you guys, stop chasing. Okay, um, two, let's get you back here. Has someone run off? Oh my god, what the hell are you guys doing all the way back there? Into position. We hear you. Come on. Attack them. Let's heal up. No, we move. As they die. Come on. Oh, hello. I didn't realize I got more. That's nice. You guys, come on up. Shoot into there. Let's go. End that quickly. Oh, phew! Bloody hell. Uh, do we have any more? Oh shit, yeah, we have a heap more. I did not see those. Uh oh. Charge! You, pull back. You guys, over this way. Get into them. Uh, we got some more reinforcements. Nice. Get you guys over here. I need all of you to retreat. You guys, forward. Holy hell. Get him! Come on! Can you guys go get that? You! Oh god, here comes that! Go, go, go! Get it! 
Get that boarding corpse before it gets to me. Push through, get the boarding corpse. Okay, that was good. Boarding corpse, you run ahead. Uh, attack the deck droppers. Holy smoly. Get those pole arms. Uh, you guys up here. You come charging around here. Get him! Get that guy! Pole arms, go get him! Where is Harkon? Go get a shot down there! Crab, intercept that guy again. The plan? Stalking! There we go. Excellent work. Now, you guys, attack this way. Let's get rid of those deck droppers. So that I can get a nice little... Oh, that's gonna miss. Bugger. Yeah, that's annoying. Come in around behind. Oh, yep, you go stop the exploders over here. Excellent. Well done. Ah, uh, you come over this way. So be it. Um, you need to stop firing. Fire at that over there. Two. Let's just get you guys lining up again, hey? And you get down and in there. That time is up. Oh, yes, get those scurvy dogs. We don't want them taking out our Queen Bess. That would be very bad. Where are those exploding corpses? Here. We don't want the dogs getting the exploding corpses, so bring them over here. Show us. How many more are there? Holy hell. Defend for four more minutes. My god. Fleet Captain! Yes, Fleet Captain, you need to run. Ah, they got my exploding corpses. Damn it. Come on. Up and over this way. You can go grab that bloated corpse. Ah, uh, you guys. Attack the crab. That crab is a danger. And I've run out of ammo. I used that too quickly, too early. Uh oh. No, get oh. Whew, that was close. Damn 
Oops, that's... yeah, that's not gonna help me. Slow him down. I'm not dead. Two. Holy moly. How much longer do I need to defend for? <laughs> Queen Bess is now useless. Get those! Get rid of them! Come on! We will kill. Yes. Go get those deck droppers, would ya? Two minutes to go. See what I mean by he doesn't seem to be running out of ammunition? It's very interesting. I'm not sure why that is. Ready to murder. Okay, so is that covering ground all of them? Done? Seems to be. Oh, okay, I defeated them all. Nice. Oh, what? Uh, and where is that coming from? I have no more magic left. Where are they? Kill the Kraken Lord. I've got no more Queen Bess ammo. Oh, yep, here they come. You guys, this way. Holy hell. Okay. I need to kill the Kraken Lord, so I'm going to focus everything I can on that Kraken Lord. I'll allow it. Uh, where are... Yeah, those guys. Let's get them in there, come on. All of you, attack the Kraken Lord. Same with you. You guys, come around here. Charge! Um, you. Why can't I cast that on him? Oh, he doesn't have casting abilities. Okay. 
I need to stop him from running. You guys, attack! Captain to you! Go! Attack! Oh, he's gone! That was quick! I didn't expect that to happen so quickly. And he's gone! Wow! Jesus, that guy must do a lot of damage. It seems like he just tore through him. They are lambs. And they've all routed. From salt. Get him! I want to actually see this, sorry, this one fire. Ready, fire, come on. Holy hell, yeah, it, okay. It's funny how it doesn't run out of ammunition though. It's very weird. Okay, well we managed to fend them all off. <laughs> the Kraken Lord went down pretty damn quickly. <laughs> That's for sure. Those fools! Freedom is not free. Okay, I'm going to replenish, just in case. The Kraken Lord is defeated. His mantle of the sea's greatest pirate is almost yours. But there remains another task to fulfill. The beast is lured to the surface. Wolfheart's harpoon yearns to be fired. Now blessed with charms hidden within the ancient sea shanties, it thrums with power. That was a very small harpoon for such a big monster. <laughs> Holy shit. Amana has risen again, but its flesh rots, for it is no longer Althuan's ancient guardian of the sea, but an undead monster within your throne. Oh. You have the ultimate prize, a treasure greater than any jewel. And with it, your infamy will spread far beyond the coasts. The seas are yours. Its prey and plunder await. I really wish you were able to verse the Kraken. But as you said, Be Queen Bess with 500 kills. She was doing pretty well. I should have used the um, replenish ammo abilities later when like Queen Bess ran out of ammunition not when she still had like half ammunition but anyway I hope you guys enjoyed that campaign because I sure as hell did I'll let the um, event feed here play out until the end through the whole sequence and then I'll just see what continuing the campaign will do. I wonder if you'd actually be able to use the sea monster. 
I don't think so. But... I guess you never know. <clears throat> I am a tad annoyed you didn't actually get to verse the monster. I was thinking that was what the final battle was going to be. Okay, this is taking a little too long. I will speed it up. Here we go. Okay. And... The war will go ever on. For that is the nature of this tribute turbulent world, but for this moment we can claim victory. Quest successful. All three verses of the Chief Sandy have been discovered and sung, unleashing the invocation of potency within the hidden lyrics. Okay, done. Yeah, no, we don't get any sea monster. <laughs> Aww. That's a shame. Oh well. I hope you all enjoyed. And I'll catch you all next time. Bye.